Gruber's pressure shield. We're not going anywhere. But Gruber, if we don't dismantle this C4 explosive, this whole building is gonna blow sky high. 60 seconds. Okay, don't worry, gang. We can do this if we work together as a team. And look, I know this whole COVID situation has really changed the game. So we gotta be smart about this, okay? We're in a small room with very limited airflow. Good call. Yeah, great thinking, McGruber. Okay, Vicky, pass me that old coffee can. You got it, McGruber. Piper, that lighter fluid. Coming out to Groobs. Now, both of you, hand me your mask. What? Why? No time to explain. Mask, now! McGruber, what, what are you doing? Freeing us from tyranny, Vic. You're welcome. Well, welcome for what? I, I, I really wanted to wear that mask. Yeah, you just said yourself that we're in a small enclosed room. Yeah, so we need every drop of oxygen we can get, which is impossible with these stupid face diapers. Oh, I can finally breathe. Hey. I gotta say, I'm a little uncomfortable with this. Don't worry, Vic. I'm vaxxed and relaxed. Here's proof. Um, I think there's a P missing at the beginning of Pfizer. You got vaccinated at a Sizzler? Sure did, Piper. And Vicky, if there was a P in front of Pfizer, it'd be pronounced Pa Pfizer. But nice try. Just admit you're not vaccinated. Okay, fine, you freaking Karens. I'm not getting that stupid shot, all right? Because I don't want the government putting a tracking device in my scrotum. Ew. But Gruber, you don't know what the hell you're talking about. Yeah, I don't need to know what I'm talking about, Piper, because I have a brain. But since you two sheeple are so freaked out, let me assure you, I'm totally anti-Semitic. Um, sorry, I'm not sure we heard you right. I don't have any symptoms. I think the word you're looking for is asymptomatic. Yeah, that's what I said. No, it's, it's not. No, I definitely said I'm anti-Semitic. Yeah, you did. So what's the issue here? McGruber, 10 seconds! Look, we may not all agree on this hoax vaccine, but one thing we can all agree on is that I do know how to defuse bombs. One second, McGruber! No, no, okay, Piper, hand me... Door's welded shut. There's no way out. And from the looks of that dynamite bomb, we've only got 60 seconds before this whole place is blown to Betsy. Not a problem, gang. We got this. And don't worry, after the last mission, I heard your concerns, and now I'm following all the protocols. Well, McGruber, there's a big hole in your mask. Uh, yeah, so I don't suffocate from all the carbo dioxide. Duh. <coughs> Look, there's no reason to be scared. I'm gonna be fine. I've done a ton of research, and I'm following the science now. That's good. <laughs> okay, Vicky, pass me that ivermectin. Okay, here. Piper, that hydroxychloroquine. Here. Gruber, do you have COVID? Hell no. Oh, thank God. I have covifilis. It's a COVID strain mixed with the uh, something else. Syphilis. Oh, <laughs> you got it. Good on you. So yeah, COVID, syphilis, and I do have an unconnected freestanding herpes in there as well. I also have horseworms. Uh, so this ivermectin's pulling double duty. <laughs> you have horseworms? Oh yeah, a bunch of them. Yeah, check this out. What? Oh my god. Oh, that's so disgusting. Relax, it's just spaghetti. Add it down here, my jockey's just waiting for the right moment to spring this little joke on you. Punked. <laughs> Look a little al dente. So you don't have horseworms? No, I do have horseworms. Oh, look, they're chopping on the spaghetti. <laughs> Leave that alone, you little turkeys. That's my food. I'm not going to eat this now. But Gruber, the bomb! Oh, okay, Piper, hand me that toilet paper with Dr. Anthony Fauci's face on it. Here. Vicky, hand me that Let's Go Brandon t-shirt. Here you go, McGruber. <laughs> so funny, huh? It actually means something else. Yeah, we know. Do you know what it means? Well, Gruber, I feel like you've gone down some kind of alt-right misinformation rabbit hole. You're all wrong about that, Karen. My information is 100% non-insane. You ever heard of QAnon? <laughs> Looks like we're trapped, McGruber. And that hydro tank bomb is set to blow in 30 seconds. So, where was I? Oh, yeah. 
So these Hollywood celebrities are eating babies. They devour them. They're insatiable, like the way horseworms eat spaghetti, raw babies, cooked babies. Eh, I'm sure they have a variety of recipes. That's what's happening out there, and nobody is doing anything about it. Can we concentrate on the bomb? Oh, that's not a big enough bomb for you to find out that Ellen Pompeo eats babies. I knew it. God, you're so brainwashed. I'm, I'm sorry, in what way? Just look at how you're dressed. Oh, forgive me for not shopping at Sheep's R Us like you. I'm just your average American who believes in limited government, my body, my choice for men, and suppressed voting rights for alternatively skinned people. Now, I'm not sure how that makes me brainwashed. McGruber, focus, please. You're right. Okay, Vicky, hand me all the remains of America's soul. What? There's nothing there. Welcome to the real world. Look, I'm just a shaman. 15 seconds. All I can do is pray for you, take up arms against you, and keep the oath I took to protect this country. Because I am an oath keeper. And boy, am I proud of that. Which I guess makes me a proud boy. Do you even understand what you're saying right now? Probably not. But Kruger, if we don't deal with this bomb, we are going to explode. Helps. Five seconds. Yeah, according to CNN. Four seconds. Cancel culture. Not my clock. Two seconds. Hollywood elite. One second. Though I do kind of like some streamers on Peacock. Oh, no!